Home Secretary Priti Patel has said she plans to introduce jet skis to keep illegal immigrants coming to the UK. Sometimes you just have to laugh. So let's take stock for a minute. At least 14,000 people have come to the UK across the English Channel illegally this year. 14,000. Weekly and daily records continue to be broken. We recently saw reports of a thousand people coming over in just one day. These people are coming from France. They are not refugees. They're not asylum seekers. They are coming here courtesy of people traffickers seeking a better life. A better life for them. It won't be a better life for us. When they arrive, they are collected by bus and taken to hotels. Then they are given pocket money while they wait for permanent accommodation to be found. During their free time, many of these illegal migrants like to go to congregate outside girls' schools. What wonderful people were importing. Priti Patel and Boris Johnson have watched this happening and done nothing at all. We've heard a few speeches full of lies, but nothing changes. Well, that's not actually true. It does change. It gets worse. So now the Home Secretary is getting tough. Her latest plan is jet skis. Patel is going to spend £200 million of your money on armoured jet skis and new boats for Border Force officers. The idea will be that the Border Force, or Border Fast to be more accurate, will use the jet skis to surround the dinghies on which migrants arrive, rotate them and guide them back towards French waters. Have you ever heard such a ridiculous idea? On top of this, existing Border Force boats will be replaced and £54 million will be paid to France for coastal patrols and surveillance. Now, for the record, We've already given £192 million to France to stop these migrants crossing. And you can see how well that's working. What a catastrophic waste of money. First of all, it is the border force that has been bringing migrants to Britain. They have had it in their power all along to send these boats back, but choose instead to bring them here. The border force is a joke. And secondly, what part of this does Priti Patel not understand? The reason these migrants are coming here is because they are invited to come here by her own government. Boris Johnson is on record. He called for an amnesty for illegal migrants. That's an invitation to the world. That's what it amounts to. When people take up this invite and make their way to Britain, they get free housing and health care. That's an invitation as well. Few, if any, of these illegal immigrants are deported, even if they commit appalling crimes. So that's also an invitation. That invitation has to be revoked. Instead of jet skis, why don't we try this? Deport anyone who comes here illegally. I don't even care where to, just as long as they're not here. Stop giving money to France for doing nothing. The French have no interest in stopping these migrants. Why would they? It means they don't have to deal with them. They must be laughing at our stupidity at this point. End any amnesty for illegal immigration and make sure that's made clear. Stop housing these people in expensive hotels. They should be held in prisons until they're sent to wherever they want to go, as long as it isn't here. Stop pandering to the left-wing media. These do-gooder journalists don't live alongside migrants. They wouldn't dream of it. They just campaign for others to live alongside these migrants. That is all that needs to happen. It's actually quite simple. But you know that the Conservative government is never going to do this. 
because it's the Conservative government that has got us into this mess in the first place. Why would you trust them to get us out? Is this stupidity or does the Tory government want this invasion to continue? And what do you think? I think it doesn't matter that much. Whether it's stupidity or intent, they are negligent in their duty to protect this country and its borders. One way or the other, the Tories are a disaster and will continue to be a disaster. It's getting very late in the day now for Britain. We only have a short time left to reclaim this nation for its people. Now, what will it take? What is your limit? When will you make change? And when will you stand up and say, I've had enough of this now? You have so much power, you just need to use it. Get up, go out, drive these fools and traitors out of Parliament. Do it. You can do it. Don't let a lack of confidence determine this. You can learn the things you don't know. You can become a strong defender of your country. You have the power to save Britain. Use it. Thank you for watching. If you would like to stay updated with all of our latest videos, please like the video below and subscribe to our channel. As you probably know, For Britain is shadow banned on most social media. So it's really important to like and share our videos in order to get our message out. Thanks again for helping us to fight back. Thanks again for helping us to bring back Britain. <laughs>